basically basically running in a river now nearly at 16 k's the rain is still relentless wind still relentless feet sopping wet obviously way at 10 wonderful this is not the joy of long distance running hey guys saturday the 24th of august i'm in the table bay mall in uh, table view stroke blauberg about to start the blauberg marathon um it's storming outside rain wind must admit the temptation to stay at home was very strong um, so yeah no great expectations for today it's basically to try and get a firstly a sub five hour run which will give me two oceans qualifier and hopefully a sub 450 which will give me a comrades qualifier uh, old age pb is a 428 don't think don't think that is a factor today a couple of weeks ago it may have been but the training has not gone to plan the last couple of weeks so we'll just see how it goes right so i will chat to you just now when we're lining up for the start okay walking to the start for some reason they put me in a batch there's not many of us so a batch is currently for the guys and the contenders for age group categories but uh, with my long distance state of fitness i won't be going for those prizes today so it's still approximately half an hour until the actual start at the moment it's not raining so it would be nice if it holds off Okay, I'll let you know once we get to the start. <laughs> 30 seconds. Remember, this course is long, it's about 300 meters long. Eh? So we're going to run a little bit ahead of time. 10 seconds to go, wait for the gun. Sorry, the gun misfired. Apologies for that. The gun was weak and it didn't come through. Okay, it's off we go. And just as we started, the rain came down. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to check you guys a little bit further on. Let's let this crowd in and I don't have to watch them. Good morning, how are you? Okay guys, we're just over one kilometer in. First K, 6.43. We're doing the nine minute run, one minute walk for today. I'm trying to keep my run sections at about 6.3 pace. But we'll see how that goes. It's very cold, very wet. My legs are taking a long time to warm up. But we keep marching on. We have got less than 41 k's to go. So not far at all. On this lovely winter's morning in Cape Town. Okay, I will check you probably when it gets a bit lighter along the route. Okay, cheers for now guys. Okay guys, so we are approaching the 6k mark. Went through 5k's in 33 minutes 20, which was uh, quicker than I thought I was running, uh, but still well within uh, the boundaries of what I'm hoping to achieve today. 
Uh, we've just had another rain shower, heavy rain shower. I'm still spitting a little bit now. It's not light yet. Um, but I'm about to take my first gel. Taking every six Ks. So I'm not expecting to run negative splits today with my lack of distance training. Morning, morning. So I'm not sure that I'll be doing my usual how many people can I overtake in the second half. But all I can say is I haven't overtaken anyone yet. And people are streaming by me this morning. But that's probably because I started pretty much at the front. Anyway, we'll give you a further report back at 10Ks. Okay, cheers fun. So I don't know how much you're going to hear of this. Wind is howling, rain's coming down. Anyhow, 10Ks, 1 hour, 5 minutes, 40 seconds. So, quite a bit quicker, a minute quicker than the first five. Feeling okay. Uh, I have actually overtaken four people in the last couple of k's. So, and it's not necessary that I picked up too much. Anyhow, as you can see ahead, we're very much in a storm. Not pleasant at all. Chat to you a little bit further on. This side here, you would normally see Robin Island, but not today. Okay, chat to you guys just now. Larbert Strand, still raining, still windy. Catch up with you now. Okay, we've just gone through 15 Ks in 138. I think I'm losing the will to live. We've had this rain now continuously, plus a howling south northwest into our faces. So it's very, very hard green. I must admit, any thoughts of time are going to tilt out the window. It's now a case of survival. And the weather is even worth continuing. But at this moment, we I'm actually been okay. Because these conditions are appalling. Chat to you guys just now. We're actually basically running in a river now. Nearly at 16 k's. The rain is still relentless. Wind so relentless. Feet sopping wet, obviously. Weigh a ton. Wonderful. This is not the joy of long distance running. Anyhow, at this moment, I'm still continuing. Check you guys just now. Let's go, guys. Huh? All the best, Ironman. This is terrible. Uh, yeah? You know what? It's an experience. It is definitely an experience. Oh, we want We take it. Yeah. We take it and we enjoy it. And we, and we try our best. My legs are pretty shot. Yeah. I, <laughs> I think everyone. Yeah. The feet are soaked. Yeah. Yep. Anyway, enjoy it. You too, eh? Sorry, your name is? Your name? Farid. Farid. Farid of Midrai. Okay. Well then, okay, well done, guys. <laughs> Looking good. Okay, guys, so we've eventually got to halfway. Two hours twenty. I've been reliably informed that the next part of the route is pretty flat and uh, at the moment we seem to be beating the rain. Let's hope it keeps that way. So we continue in. Uh, so the legs feel very heavy. They are warming up a little bit. It's not that cold, um, but obviously the wind's blowing and we're obviously so soaking wet, so that's making you cold. But we're gonna keep plodding on here and we'll keep giving you updates as we get along. Cheers for now. Okay guys, look at this. Sunshine, blue skies. Suddenly feeling quite a bit better. Okay, 25 and a half K is done. Uh, not really been keeping an eye on the actual times. I've been running for two hours 49 at the moment. 
Thank you. Thank you. So I've been having fun. I've been chatting with people and walking when I feel like it. Time has become totally irrelevant. So I was talking with uh, Farid, uh, a YouTube follower, telling me about some of his exploits. Running a 50k trail run on his 50th birthday. Just for the heck of it, having one of the best races he's ever had. That's what it's all about, guys. So I was quite ready to give up at 14k's with the weather like it was. I'm feeling tired now, don't get me wrong. Uh, but I'm, I'm glad I didn't, I'm glad I persisted. So we're now in a place called Melkboss. Uh, we're gonna do a loop round Melkboss and then we're gonna go back onto the road we came on, heading back to Blauberg Strunt, where we will finish. The good news is, is that once we get onto that section, we'll have the wind behind our backs to push us all the way. So I'm gonna give you an update at 30 kilometers, if not before. Oh, and just to tell you, this is now the officially the longest I've run since Comrade. Okay, check you guys just now. Okay, we're approaching 29 Ks, and that is Kuburg Nuclear Power Station ahead. As you can tell, still pretty windy. It also appears to be getting a little darker again. And I will soon be, hopefully, on our return home with the wind behind us. Okay, chapter 30. Okay, guys, 30k is done. And am I done? Not far off. <laughs> 3 hours 19. So, quick, uh, quick maths here which is not my strong point at this stage, but I think that's uh, an hour and 31 minutes to do 12 Ks to make the Comrades qualifier, and an hour 41 to make the two oceans. So, I don't know, I'm not making predictions at this stage. I'm going along quite nicely at the moment. I'm doing four and a half minute run, 30 second walk, and keeping about six and a half minute pace but I am feeling tired. But anyhow, the second half, as they say, of the marathon is about to start. So I'll keep you updated at 35, but probably before. Um, I'm hopeful that we're gonna have the wind behind us very soon. But yeah, otherwise we are actually not too bad to say that I was ready to bail at 14 days. Okay, time for another goo. And then I've only got one more left to take, which will be at 36 days. Okay guys, chat to you now now. Okay guys, 32 k's done. Three hours, 32. <coughs> so that's giving me one hour, 17 to do 10 k's to get the comrades qualifier and obviously 127 for a two oceans qualifier so i think bar major accident the two oceans one should be achievable and with a bit of luck i've got an outside chance on the comrades one it's just under eight minutes a k and i'm between six and a half and seven minutes a k at the moment averaging so if I can keep that up, then I should do it. But we're not going to count our chickens until they hatch. In a marathon, I start feeling happier once I get to about 37 k's. I've still got five k's to go till we get to that stage. So officially tired, officially hit the wall. Probably officially hit the wall a long time ago. But we're still moving. Uh, just an amount of interest. I am majority of the time overtaking people. I'm obviously on a walk break at the moment. That's why there's people going by me. But generally speaking, I am overtaking people. So, but I'm not counting, it's pointless. Today, I'm not feeling strong enough to K 
get a hundred or whatever in this last 10 k's. Okay, we'll chat to you just now, guys. Okay, guys, so we're 34 k's done. We're now in Melkbos. This is uh, the beach with a rather angry looking sea. We are now resorted to walking two lampposts, running four. Uh, but we're still keeping the pace to seven minutes a k. So, so far so good. I'm not stressing. This is uh, gonna enjoy best I can the rest of this run. Eight, so just under eight k's to go. One, two, three! Yeah. Happy people handing out water. It's only water bus. Okay, chat you guys just now. One thing which I forgot to mention, which is a little bit disconcerting, is that the last official kilometer board we had was at 19 k's. So, don't actually know if this course is running long or whatever. I'm relying totally on my watch and that could be way out. But as I say, our first, first target was the Two Oceans Qualifier. I think that should be fine. I think we should get that. And look, there's still a hell of a long way to go. I've still got my October Marathon, where hopefully I'll be a lot fitter than I am now. Okay, I'll chat you guys just now. Okay, 35K is done. Three hours 55, which means I've got 55 minutes to make the Comrades qualify. 7Ks, I think that's cutting it fine. Especially as I'm not gonna put myself out too much. Okay, I'll check you guys further along the route. At least we are now on the road, which takes us back to the finish. And we should have the wind behind us, although the wind as normal appears to have dropped. Okay, I will chat you guys shortly. Okay, 37 Ks, four hours, near as damn it, 10 minutes. So that is 40 minutes to do 5 Ks. Tall ask, I'm afraid, at this stage. I'm keeping my Ks between seven and seven and a half minutes a K. Get a couple of six minutes in there again don't know actually how far we have to go i'm saying that's five k's per my what but uh you've still got the point two as well after that so i think comrades qualifier we can forget but two oceans we should get we should get the two oceans okay chat you guys further along the route okay 39 k's not on mine three hours 24. So, 26 minutes to do the last 3.2. Pushing it, pushing it. The last K, I did manage to run a sub seven minutes. But it's a big ask for three. Okay, update you at 40 k Just a matter of interest, there's Robin Island wasn't visible earlier and the cloud over there is Table Mountain which I don't think we're going to see today okay, okay 40k is done on my watch four hours 31 so 19 minutes to do 2.2 approximately thank you It's amazing what hard work this is. Okay, this is my walk break basically over. Check you guys at 41. Okay guys, 41k is done on my watch. Four hours 38. So, if the course was accurate to my watch, I would have a good chance of doing it. However, I have a feeling 
this course is measuring quite long so it's going to be touch and go but we'll see we can only try I'll catch up with you just before the finish bye for now So approximately 600 meters to go, six minutes to do it in, and they gave us this little beauty. It's so touch and go. Gonna walk another one of these and then gonna give it all I've got. Or the at this stage approximately half a K. Okay. okay, check you a little bit further on. Okay, so the full marathon on my watch 446. I know we're approaching the finish. Ah. You know you're tired when you know the finish is around this corner, but you have to take a water break. Okay, I'm gonna chat to you around the corner. Okay, got just over two minutes. I'm hoping the finish is around this corner. And I'm sure she was waiting for the voice this morning. It couldn't have been easy. And she finishes the race in style. I almost missed it for the very first time in 204 races on the microphone. Jill She's come 42.2 kilometers to hear her voice as she crosses the finish line. It's not easy conditions this morning. Simon Speck is also here this morning. Thank you. 448, guys. You've done it. Qualified. He's rose. That was hard going, guys. Really hard, man. This is Simon. I believe you absolutely smashed it today. <laughs> comrades qualifier done. We'll see about the comrades, but... You left your husband in the dust. Now you get there, you get Yeah, there. I know what I'm talking about. So, well, very well done. It was a tough race. It was very tough, that weather at the start. the first half, oh. really got us. But, yep, I also did it, and I'm... Uh, as, as your husband said, I had two minutes to spare, so I was too quick. Lovely, lovely. Too quick. But, yeah, nice meeting you guys. And, and, yeah. keep well, eh? You too. Okay, keep well, keep well. Okay, How did you go? Okay. Huh? Well, well, I, I just assisted my... Oh, you assisted? My, yes, yes, yes. You took the easy route? Just, just, just to get there. No, no, that's what the easy run. No, that's, that's what, my, what my wife says. It's actually the supporting and the helping yeah. is harder than running. Yes, So yes, well yes, done yes. to you. Yes, yes. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you very okay. much. Okay. And your name is? Iksan. Iksan. Okay, yeah. cool. So Cape Town Marathon next, we're going uh, to try Possibly Cape Town, Yeah. Um, but I'm also hoping to do an overseas marathon, which is on the same day. Okay, So I'm, nice. hopefully I can do some training Yes. and, yes. and improve my seating Lovely. quite nicely. Lovely, you must enjoy it then. I okay. will, okay. Cool. Cheers, uh, cheers all. And now, I need to find my supporter. Uh, well, I am very glad I didn't do what was definitely going through my head of 14 Ks, which was to run back to the start. Um, but at that section in that rain and the wind, oh, I didn't think I was going to make it. Uh, to finish, never mind qualify. I there. But yeah, look, I recognize this lady with lots of shopping. Your clothes. Okay, on my clothes, it's not shopping. So that was bloody hard. Was it? Bloody hard, but I qualified, but which I can't believe. It. Amazing. Can't believe. Amazing. Uh, yeah. When we got to 14 Ks, which was just here, I was very tempted to run back to the shopping center. Is it? It was absolutely gale. Gale, storm. We were running through 
shoe deep water anyhow so you'll see it's on the footage <laughs> but and now persevered and when the sun came out it uh, got a little easier and so very happy guys please yeah please like and subscribe and you can see more fun like this video was <laughs> fun. But, yeah yeah but we did meet lots of uh, YouTube subscribers today which was great interviewed quite a lot of you it was nice some of the marshals shouting are you IB pro fun and I'm saying yes and they're shouting I watch your videos they're fantastic oh, that's nasty, yeah? so yeah if you haven't subscribed already guys please subscribe and uh, please you can buy us a coke or rather buy us a coffee thanks so much and cheers for now